Hey guys, so today I'm actually going to film a what is in my iPhone um, and I actually have my iPhone right here. It is the iPhone 6s Plus in rose gold and ignore my sister there who is, you know, just chilling there. In the background? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Anyway, uh, so this is my phone right here and like I said, it's iPhone 6s rose gold and this is how my case looks. It is just um, like diagonal white and then the other half is like this really pretty rose gold um, color and yeah so this is how it looks I'm actually going to try a new thing I'm going to try the whole like iPhone screen on the side of me so we'll see how that works out let's get started okay so this is my iPhone obviously and this is my lock screen is it's this uh, fluffy um, how do I explain it it's just really, I don't know, I just think it looks cozy and like fun and pink and I just love it so much. Um, I actually had a marble one before but I kind of got like, I get super, super, super tired of like the same wallpaper. So I can't go like more than three days without changing my um, wallpaper because I just get really annoyed and tired of them really easily. So anyway, that's my front screen. So now to my main screen. I have the exact same wallpaper for my home screen. And all these wallpapers, if you guys are wondering, I actually get them um, on Pinterest. I just look them up and um, yeah, they're like really, they're, oh, there's so many on Pinterest. Um, okay, so now starting with the front page. I only have two pages as you guys can see. So the front page, I just have my FaceTime messages calendar which I use so much for college because I love to like putting stuff that are like major events I have my own actual agenda book uh, my own planner that I write in but this is just for like major events that I like to write stuff um, like for example for example on October 7th there is the style hall celebration in Chicago so I'll be going there and it's just a reminder I have photos and as you, guys, as you guys can see, I, I don't have a lot of photos at all, and the reason for this is because I get rid of them, and you'll see um, more on to the, into this video, you'll see why I get rid of them. Then I have my camera, I have my weather app, um, I have my clock, and I have so many alarms because this is like, just for my mornings I have like five alarms because I can never wake up. Then I have notes, which I use for everything, like to-do list mostly. And then I have maps, and then I have Google Maps, which I actually use the most for my campus. I like to put the address of the building because my campus is really big, so I, I put the location of the building. And then I put walking distance. It'll tell me how long it'll take to walk there. And so it's really, really helpful. Um, super, super helpful for that. Then I use reminders for a lot of things like, oh, bring $15 to class or something like that. Then I have iTunes Store, Calculator, App Store. These are just like the basic ones on the front. Um, home, useless to be honest. And then the Gmail app, which I use way more than the actual, the other one. I don't use the other, um, the mail one. I think I deleted that one. Unless I'm blind. But anyway, yeah, I use that one for my main emails. And then I use, I have voice memos, which I do not use feedback and then settings and then in the bottom I have phone, Safari, contacts and music. So now on to the next one. The first app I have is Instagram and if you guys want to follow me on Instagram it's just Jalitza Palomino same as YouTube just all together um, and I actually got rid of a lot of photos and then I've been trying to keep up with the theme you guys can see towards the top it's more of like a white theme or trying to have a white theme so um, yeah, if you guys want to follow me on that and then I have Twitter and this is my Twitter if you guys want to follow me on there as well. It's Jalitz, just Jalitz Palomino. Same, same thing. Then I have Snapchat and, um, hey guys. Oh, this is so cool. Um, anyway, I have Snapchat. And for my Snapchat, if you guys just want to take a picture of that, or um, my Snapchat username is just Jalitza, J E L I T Z A. That's it. If you guys want to follow me on Snapchat, you guys can go ahead and. The next app I have is Facebook, which is kind of like for family and stuff. I do not really go on Facebook other than for family or just to once in a lot, once in a big while I usually go there, but other than that I don't. Then underneath my Instagram app I have the app UNUM, and this is, I don't really know how this works, but all I know, all I use it for is to like put pictures on there that I'm debating whether to post. So the ones that have like a little Instagram symbol on the right 
bottom corner those are the ones that i already posted so there's this photo right here and that one i was debating whether to put it like if it would go with my white theme or not and i didn't really like the way it looked on my instagram feed so i didn't put it but that's just like a way to know before you actually put it on instagram to know if it'll actually look good with your instagram theme if you have one so the next one i have is pinterest which i literally use for everything i don't really pin a lot of stuff um uh, i just look i just go on the search bar and like for example, I was trying to take pictures of of Starbucks. So, like, these are examples of Starbucks. Um, these are examples of, like, Starbucks uh, pictures for Instagram. That's where I get my ideas. Um, then I have this safe upload app, which is good for uh, when you have a photo and you weren't able to upload it on Snapchat, but you really want to put it on Snapchat for, like, 24 hours. Then that's a good app to put. Then I have Facebook Messages. Tumblr, which I really do not use because I do not really understand it. I feel like this is the same thing as Instagram, so I don't really use it. But if you guys want to follow me on this, it's just Jalitza Basic. Um, that's my Avi, and yeah, I don't really know how this works, so. Okay, so that's that. And then I have a folder right here, YouTube folder. I have my studio, which is good for, um, oh shoot, I have studio app, which is good for, like, for replying to comments, and then, um, for just, just the basic, uh, just for, basically I use it just for commenting back. Then I have this iTalk, which is good for voiceovers, and I used it before I actually got my microphone, but since I have a microphone now, I don't need to use that. And then I have the YouTube app, so I hope you guys all know what that is. Then I have my editing app and um, Facetune, Afterlight, and VSCO are the main ones that I use. Um, the bottom one's not really. The only one I use um, from the bottom one is called Pick Joiner, and that one I use for um, thumbnails. I just go to here and go to size and 16 by 9. That's the thumbnail size, and that's how I usually do my thumbnails. Um, unless I do, unless I use Pick Mon Monkey, then I use th that. But then I have my college app, college folder, and have my college app. Then I have Slug Books, Slug Books, which is a good app for cheap books. And then I have Kudzu, Kudzu, and it's like an app where I haven't used it yet. It's just have it. It's just an app where you can um, put your grades in and kind of get rewards for it. Like you earn, you earn like discounts or money or coupons or um yeah, you, you earn rewards and you can shop on it um shop with it through here then i have canvas which is an app um that my school uses to kind of what every teacher uses and um then i have group me which is a f i don't really know how this works but it's like group me group messaging so this is for like Thompson. This is for the my my hallway. All of these are from my uh, hallway, my dorm. So we all can communicate somehow. And then the next folder I have is health, and it's the period tracker, which I have not used it yet. I need to use it. Um, and then I have the Swerk it, which I haven't used it either. I did have one one day. I did have, I did use this a couple times, but then I stopped using it, so I should probably get back to it because it's actually really, really beneficial. Then I have the Urban Outfitters app, which I love so much. I can't, I can't get enough Urban Outfitters. Expensive but cute. Retail me not, so whenever I'm around stores, it tells me what stores um, have specials going on or discounts going on. So then I have the wear app and this wear oh actually I have a different app. This wear app is great for um I get I use this for inspiration for outfits as you guys can see people post your oh shit uh people post outfits uh sent well, what the heck people post outfits on this and I don't really use it right now because I barely got it because I am actually I had to get this app for my class intro to a pair of uh, intro to a pair of merchandising, and I had to get this app. So um, I did, but so far I use it for inspiration. So that's a good app if you want inspiration. Then I have my bank Intera Bank uh, app, 
Shazam. You guys all know what that is. I hope it's just when I don't know a name of the song and I just search the song. Okay. Then I have Spotify and I actually have Spotify Premium. Best, best app ever. I love this so much. And my, if you guys want to follow me on mine, mine is, where's mine at? Mine is just Jalita underscore Palomino. Then I have this color app, and this color app is just for fun. I really, I use it when I'm really, really bored, but it's super fun. Let me, let me show you guys how, how this works. So you gotta get it through the same color, and it changes colors every time I use, so it's kind of difficult. I kind of get frustrated, so like I kind of get frustrated all the time because I low key suck at this game. Oh, I'm doing good. Oh, I spoke too soon. Okay, best score nine. I got score of five. So, and the sad part was the best score nine wasn't even me playing it. Next up I have is this cash app, which is very cool that I just found out about it with my, with my friend, and it's very safe, and it's an app where you can transfer money. For example, my sister wanted to transfer me money, um, wanted to transfer me $3, $10, $20, $200, $300, or whatever. She would just type in, okay, I'm going to send her $200, and then she can pay, she can pay to me, or I can request $20 from her. So on. Uh, after three days, it will go directly onto my bank accounts. Even if you have different bank accounts. So the next app I have is a voice record, and that one was just um, I had to download it for class as well, same class as the Wear app. And then Canva was for editing photos, I believe. I had also downloaded that. Haven't used it yet, but I'm supposed to, I was supposed to. Uh, it's a requirement though for my class. Then this is the most important one, guys. This one is Google Photos, and Google Photos is this new thing where um, you can store all your photos on Google, and that is why I got rid of all my photos here because all my photos that I take on here transfer directly to Google Photos. I set it up like that so it can automatically set up to that. So I literally have all my photos right here. It's crazy. And um, then right here, I have, it says like backing up photos like it tells you it like right away when you take it it backs it up which is awesome and the reason why I deleted them from my actual phone is because I don't have enough I never have enough space which sucks but this Google app this Google photos app saved my life then over here I totally I totally forgot about this um, side these two are actually this one first one is actually was a requirement for class as well I don't really know how this whole thing works so I'm still trying to get the hang of it. Subscribe or continue with the free basic next. Um, oh, so yeah. See, I have no idea what the heck I'm doing. So I'll wait for that. And then the next one I got, and my friend told me about it, it's called SeatGeek. And I'm trying to get some football tickets with this for my home school that is about to play. So, um, yeah. That is the app. I don't really know how to use that. That's so sad. I just I have apps in here that I've never touched before, but I will soon. I know I will. That is all I have for what's my. That is all I have on my iPhone. Um, I used to have a whole bunch of stuff, but I get rid of so much because I I had so many shopping apps, but I knew that I had to stop shopping. I'm in college. I don't got money for shopping, so I deleted them because they were just temptations. So I got rid of a lot of apps here. But, um, so yeah, that is all I have on my iPhone. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and, um, give it a thumbs up if you did. Don't forget to subscribe. And, yeah, I will see you guys next time. Bye.